busy freeway, a Bondi Vet camera crew are caught up in traffic chaos. No! Mother Duck and her babies have taken a tragic wrong turn. People are just stopping, cars are stopping, there's people jumping out of their cars and just scrambling around the cars trying to catch these little ducklings. Careful, in a panic, the Mother Duck flies off, abandoning her ducklings. One right under your car here. Now orphaned, it's imperative the chicks are caught and brought to safety. Jeez, one just went under a car. Oh, it's out the other side, I think. Going right out that side. Jeez, they're quick. This is crazy. Right now, legs officer. The Good Samaritan couple are now taking nine ducklings to the nearby Sash Hospital. Sadly, there has already been one casualty. No, one got run over. There's nine birds. One of them was hit by the car. If you could just come up and, and have a look, please, that would be appreciated. After a frantic rescue mission, Alicia and David have just arrived at Sash with the nine orphan ducklings. One other chick died on the motorway. Oh, no, I don't know it's hard. <laughs> Definitely. Hi, little guys. Look at you. Emergency vet Lisa Chimes now needs to check over the babies for any serious injuries. So remarkable that this couple stopped their car in the middle of a freeway, jumped out and tried to rescue these little ducklings. I mean, they could have endangered their own lives. We couldn't have left them there. Like wouldn't have forgive ourselves if we did. I'm looking for signs of head trauma, feeling their limbs and seeing if they've got any breaks in their wings and their bones. I mean, if these ducks are so tiny and so fragile that if they came into contact with a tyre or a car or anything on that freeway, they would not have stood a chance. No, you did good. Look at them, nine out of ten. And it's thanks to you. I think it's um, an amazing effort. Thank you so much. Come on, little guys. Thank you. We don't actually get ducks here very often, so I've raided the fridge and stolen someone's lettuce for their lunch. This is service. I don't even cook like this for myself. Chopped it up finely, soaked it in water, and that's what they're going to get until I can find some proper duck food. Oh, <laughs> I love that. Oh, my God. <laughs> I've asked the nurses here if they can look after the ducks, but the hospital's full, we're busy. It's been told Lisa, take them home, keep them warm and bring them back alive tomorrow. No pressure. This time, you're going to be strapped in. At SASH, Lisa's shift is over, but the real work's just about to begin. She's on her way home to play foster mum to nine lucky ducklings. you be good in the car, little duckies. The chicks were rescued from a motorway after their mum had left them to fend for themselves. Hello. Hi. Look what I've got. They're staying for the night. What the? In the bathroom. Why? It's a big surprise for Lisa's husband, Brad, and their four-legged family, Nelson and Lucas. Nice to the baby duck. Love him. The dogs got one look at the cage. I let them meet their new brothers and sisters. And then Nelson licked his lips and that was it. The boys are staying here. Wait there, wait. Just wait, just wait. We'll come back to you in a second. I don't want to stress the ducks out too much, so the dogs have been banished and they are not happy. He loves you. Yes. Oh, my goodness, Brad. <laughs> I don't know if Brad's cut out to be a father just yet. He's not coping very well. How many of these he are there? You. We've got nine babies, Brad. Lisa. What? They've gone under the sink. Yeah, don't know if this is so good for the marriage. Brad, what are you doing? You're meant to be watching them. There they come. <laughs> no, 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 not on the bed. Go to bed. Everyone to bed. Come on, kids. In you go. Bedtime! One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Bedtime! They'll be alright, Brad. Don't worry. They'll be okay. Nine. 
so I'm a little bit sad. My little family's going. Aww. It was fun while it lasted, hey buddies? Lisa's nine orphans have made it through the night. Hi. Hi. Now she's reluctantly handing Hi, them over Lisa. to the experts. We're lucky we've got some babies in care at the moment with an adult. Okay. So we'll just add them to the brood. I think there'll be 19 babies with one adult. You're cute. Oh, that's how you thank me. <laughs> hey? Surrogate mums, they can't count. Another nine ducklings, no problem. All right. Good Thanks luck. very much, Lisa. Let me know what happens with them. Absolutely, and we'll be in touch. Maybe when we release them. Hopefully. Okay. Take care. See you later. Bye. Thank you. Thank Bye. you. I'm actually looking forward to a good night's sleep tonight. Yeah, good luck to him. I can't wait for you to see them, Lisa. Yeah. They've grown so much. Can't wait to see them as well. And wow, what a spot for their new home, huh? Lisa has caught up yep. with Neil from the rescue group Wires to say goodbye to the baby she took in eight weeks ago. They don't look much like babies anymore, Lisa. Well, they're ready to go. I've definitely stirred the pot here. I've been thinking about these little guys for the last few months, wondering how they're doing, and I'm so excited to see how big they've grown and to hopefully set them free in the water where they belong. Here we go! Oh my goodness. Oh, look at That's that. That's amazing. It's beautiful. Wow. I'm Dr. Danny Dusek from Bondi Vet. If you love our show and want to see more, plus some amazing content about pets and how to care for them, hit the subscribe button. Click that little notification bell and we'll see you on our next video.